Hello everyone, Sigma Later here. Welcome back to Resident Evil Code Veronica. Let's get rid of you. I think the gold key's only a single use. I can't remember. Yes, single use. Good. Message to the new family master. Sir Alfred, congratulations on your succession as master of the Ashford family. I hereby, hereby present to you present you with an earthenware vase according to the Ashford family tradition. As you may know, this tradition first began when a butler presented a golden teacup as a commemorative to Veronica. As founder of the Ashford family, her intelligence and beauty are legendary. The second and third masters, Stanley and his son Thomas, were also presented with similar teacups. It was their it was their hope to achieve glory as Veronica did before them. The position of family master then shifted from Sir Thomas to his twin brother Sir Arthur. It then went for, it then went to Sir Edward, your grandfather. That was then the Ashford family. In, that that was when the Ashford family enjoyed its golden age. It was also Sir Edward's achievement that established the large chemical enterprise Umbrella Inc. However, when Sir Edward passed away and your father Sir Alexander succeeded the position, the glorious Ashford family gradually began to sink. I sincerely hope that the Ashford family regains its glory with your guidance, just as this vase continues to shine eternally. Scott Harmon, butler to the Ashford family. Right. Let's get the old trusty pen and paper. It was, uh... A lot of information there to solve this puzzle. Right, so... V Veronica was the first... She was given uh, a golden teacup. Second and th third masters. So we've got second S Stanley, third Thomas. Patricia Family Master then shifted from Sir Thomas to his twin brother, Arthur. All right, how wait. Arthur, it then went for, to Sir Edward. So, fifth is Edward. Okay, and then it went to Alexander. And then finally to Alfred Wright. Oh, this puzzle was probably my least favorite out of all the Resident Evil puzzles. Okay, so, beautiful woman holding a tea set, there is a button, 
Yes. So we do that one first. Picture of a man with a pure white candlestick. It's also illustrated. There's a button below. No. Red haired man. Earthenware plate. No. Ah, I imagine this is Stanley. He's holding twins. And the twins were Thomas and Arthur. Where's the button below? I'll hold off on that one for now. Redhead man holding a tea set. Earthenware vase. Right, I think. Right, I think you are last. I think you are Stanley. You are Thomas. You, I believe, to be Arthur. I think you're Edward. And then you are Alexander. And then Alfred. Trace the Ashford legacy, reveal the true master. Yes! <laughs> I'm a genius. We'll take the vase. So portrait of Alexia. A floral earthenware pot is also illustrated. Yes, we'll take what's inside. We now have the Queen Ant. Oh, that I used that puzzle used to give me so much trouble. Head back upstairs to the uh, where Norman Bates's mother lives. Whoa, hello. This one lacks the impact of uh crossbow from the original Resident Evil 2. Right, 
how many bolts did I use? A, a fair amount. <coughs> I know I have exploded bolts back in the crate, but I'm trying to save those for later. Stairs, please, Claire. Well, at least the bats are gone. here so I can see you. Uh, there's still some more out there. You are red. Yes. Am I? I'm still good. I want to come around here so I can actually see you. I don't like f firing blindly into the distance anymore. Hi! Yes, I remember I need to find the dragonfly to put into you. Uh, 
There it is. So, so the wings can be detached, detach the wings, yes. Nothing in there? Alright. Cool. Yeah, climb the ladder. <laughs> Newspaper clip. A ten-year-old girl genius graduated at the top of her class from a prestigious university. The International Corporation Umbrella Chemical Inc. offered her the position of head researcher. I see. Alright. Yes, I'll have those. Ah, shiny book up above. What do you have for me? Confession letter. Alexia, my sister is a genius and possesses unmatched beauty. She is everything to me. I would overcome any obstacle and be willing to risk my own life for her. For Alexia, I must revive the glorious Ashford family which failed during the era of my father, Alexander. Together we will, we will restore our family name. Once that has been achieved, I'll build a palace where only nobles may gather I cannot allow the unwashed to see my dear Alexia, to whom my life is devoted devoted to. She reigns the world as queen, with I as her servant. That is my dream, and how sweet it will be. Those accomplishments will be the proof of my love toward Alexia. It is the purpose of my existence. All other people are meaningless, and they shall soon prostrate themselves before Alexia and I, devoted to my beloved Alexia, Alfred Ashford. Ah, the 18th century attitude of nobility. Ah, there, yes. Now we've got you. We can finally get out of this hell hole. Other at last. A pity I must say goodbye so soon. I am Alexia Ashford. For the pride of the Ashford family, I will kill you. Yeah, that's not designed for close range. Wait! What's going on? Are you okay? I'm fine. It's just a scratch. Drama queen. It's 
Steve seems to be uneasy. I'd better check this room. Alexia's dress is Alexia's dress is abandoned. This must be. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Alfred. <laughs> what? No! <laughs> Wait a second. What just happened? So there never was an Alexia after all. You mean, he thinks he's two people? Okay, that's it. Let's get out of here. The self-destruct system has been that freak. activated. He's trying to blow us all up along with the entire facility. Immediately. Come on, we gotta get to that airport. Right. It wouldn't be Resident Evil without a self-destruct system. Haha, <laughs> island go boom. They're climbing the stairs. I don't know if you've. I don't know if you got the memo, buddy, but the place is about to blow up. Forgot the zombies could actually climb stairs in this one. Uh, excuse me. I think I've got time to get to the uh, air base. Uh, first, let's get rid of you. No. Take you. And you. Excuse me. Claire, 
Hey, Steve. Those must be the remaining survivors. We'd better get out of here, too. Right. Let's go. I, I didn't see evidence of other survivors, but hey ho. Yeah, I know, Steve. Didn't really need to see that, but fair enough. Of me, fair enough. There we go. This seems like a really inefficient way to get on board a plane. Yeah, there's ink ribbon right there, Claire. Alright. It's that time again, I'm afraid. I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch this, guys. If you liked it, like, subscribe, ding that bell. I've been Sigma Later. This has been Resident Evil Code Veronica X. And I'll catch you next time. Take care now. Oh.